So recently, people have been asking me in the comments, how do you do this? Or basically, how do you zoom into your screen live when you're recording? Maybe some people know that there is this thing called magnifier, Windows magnifier. This is a built-in tool and using this, you can zoom in to your screen like this live you can also use keyboard shortcut windows plus plus key or minus key to zoom in and out just like that simple clean okay but the problem with this is that you can't change the keyboard shortcuts you'll have to use two hands to zoom into your screen if you want to use the keyboard shortcut windows plus plus key okay it's far apart okay it's pretty good okay i like it but you know, I don't use this tool. Uh, I use this tool called Glass Brick. This tool is basically a Windows magnifier tool, but it has many options. Plus you can customize the keyboard shortcuts and much more, okay? So basically uh, you can do this and look at the transition. It's really smooth compared to uh, the magnifier. Okay, let me try this. Okay, I'm gonna gonna do the keyboard shortcut to zoom in look at that i don't like that it's it's like quick you know zoom there is this little you know animation but it's too quick okay but when i do this with glass brick look at that it's smooth okay it feels smooth much better plus you can change many settings uh like uh, the tracking how the tracking will work like follow mouse or border when it reaches to a certain point you can you can see i have set it to 50 so i can decrease it increase it and all that you can keep it in center so it will move with the mouse and the quality when you zoom in is as good as the uh, windows magnifier there is no difference you know there are many other you know magnifiers but there is nothing better than glass brick I have tested many, many of I've been using this for a long time now. And uh, yeah, uh, since people were asking, what are you using and all that? So yeah, I thought let's make a video about it. This is a cool software, okay? So for whatever reason, you have to use Windows Magnifier or you use Windows Magnifier, you know, try this out. This is pretty cool, much better. You can customize it. Again, there are many customization options like uh, you can set up the custom keyboard shortcuts. Okay, uh, you can uh, set up the animations like uh, how fast the zooming in and out animation goes. Like uh, right now, it's set to medium. Let's do it at the slowest. I'm gonna zoom out now, it's gonna go slow like that. <laughs> Let's set it to fast. Wow, it's instant. Okay. <laughs> So medium is pretty good for me because I make videos, so it's, it's, it's good. This is actually really useful software for me. And again, as I said, if you're someone who uses uh, a Windows magnifier or you need to magnify your uh, screen, you should try this out, yeah. And I wanna give you guys one more extra tip, okay? If you want to also make tutorials, you, know, you wanna record videos, you may notice that when you try to record, your screen with magnifier any magnifier software actually there will be two mouse cursors when you zoom in but in my videos you'll see there is only one mouse cursor so if you see two mouse cursors when you use glass brick go to your sources and your screen capture uh, profile and then go to properties and in here uh, by default it should be as automatic okay change this to dxgi desktop duplication when you do that it won't capture your mouse cursor okay it won't be able to uh, capture your mouse cursor okay uh, but when you launch the glass break it will i don't know why but it will capture your mouse cursor so let me actually exit this glass break now you can't see the mouse cursor you can see i'm right clicking but you don't see the mouse cursor but when i launch glass break now you can see the mouse cursor see so 
yeah that's just extra tip for you guys if you also want to record your videos with this software that's it for this one hope you enjoyed it but if you still have any questions or any suggestions for me you can always do the comment and we can try to have some chit chat in the comment section too yeah that's it i'll see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun bye, -bye.